welcome back to Try Hard Tuesdays, a series where I just try to win with like the stupidest, most dumb, like the most, the most like the teams that make you just go Ugh, when you see it, you know, I just went with those teams and it's really fun. You'll enjoy it. Uh, I'm your sleep deprived host, Troubadour. And you know how I'm feeling right now? You know how I'm feeling right now? I'm feeling like, all right, so I just got off a 14 and a half hour shift. I was working like 6.30 a.m. to 9 p.m. And like, dude, it's so long. And I got home, I ate dinner. You know what? I care about you guys from gosh darn it. Tomorrow's Tuesday. I gotta have a Try Hard Tuesdays episode out. So that's how I'm feeling right now. Okay, I'm better now. Took a few minute break. I'm feeling better, I'm calmed down. Everything's normal, I'm, I'm normal. Okay, let, let me elaborate a bit. So I've been working, um, what day is today? Today's Monday, what am I saying? I'm recording this for y'all tomorrow. Um, I've been working 10 to 12 hours a day since Thursday and doing a lot of uh, manual labor at work. So a lot of, you know, it's just, I'm tired. <laughs> that's really, the, that's the gist of it, I'm tired. Uh, thankfully, I've got a lot of footage um, that I've got saved up for just such an occasion, which is great because that means it'll be editing a lot easier the rest of the week uh, But in the meantime, uh, let's talk about this team here So the whole idea of this team is I want you know chili chili's a cool food, right? Does five damage to the pet behind the one you attacked you know some nice splash damage But you know what? I think we can do better than that. You know what? We can do more than five. How about 10? 15 20, you know Let's go higher, 40, 60, no, 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 no. You know what we're gonna do? By the end of this video, I'm gonna have Chili doing 80 damage. That's right, we're gonna be one shotting some fools with the Chili, just you wait. Uh, but the whole idea here is that we have a, uh, we have a Panther, and Panther, it'll uh, make the effects of its held food perk do uh, two, three, and four times more effective at higher levels, so Chili will go from doing five damage to doing 10, 15, and 20. And then on top of that, we're going to have a visitor on our team. Visitor is from the Unicorn Pack. It gives the exposed ailment that makes the enemy take double damage twice. So basically, if they're exposed, that means the Chili on the Panther will go from doing 20 damage to 40 damage. And then we add in a Manticore. Now, it doesn't make it go up to 80 at level one. It actually just adds an extra like multiplier on it so it goes from like uh 40 to 60 and then if we have a level two manticore or two level ones it'll be level 80 by the end so that's what we're gonna do here now we do find our panther and our tar we got lots of money here to start getting it statted up we found another panther like we're already almost at like our level three panther that's amazing um in the meantime um, I'm just gonna have the tar in front of the big panther. Hopefully that can take out some people. I'm still looking for the visitor right now, which almost rolled past it. There it is. Gonna go ahead and freeze that for later. Uh, we face a kind of a jumping team. Not really, it's kind of just jumper plus good pets. I don't know, but look at that. 15 damage already on the panther chili. That's awesome. All right, so we're gonna bring in the visitor now. Fill a blobfish onto it. We wanna get higher leveled because at level three, it'll target more enemies. Um, now, you might say, why don't you just put a mushroom on the visitor? That way it can do it more than once. Now, here's the thing. Visitor does not skip enemies that already are exposed when it's applying it again. So if it's like a level two with mushroom, the exposed will hit the front two enemies and then it will come back and it'll hit the front two enemies with exposed again. So you can't just like cover a whole team with it, which is fair. That'd be kind of crazy having the whole team exposed for level two brush mushroom. It'd be kind of dumb. Uh, we grab a poodle here. Uh, one thing I found very helpful was the running a poodle, just because we have a lot of different pets from different tiers. And honestly, this combo doesn't work very well unless you have stats, especially on the panther. The panther stats are the most important because the higher health on the panther means the more times it gets to trigger its uh, chili. Look at that, 30 damage on the blowfish with the chili. I think it was 30 with the exposed, that's insane. We're gonna see that number just go even higher during this, so this is gonna be awesome. Grab the stingray just to get a little bit more stats on my visitor. I wanna be a little bit, you know, just to have, have at least some stats on it. 
Also, here's another thing. If you do want to try this yourself, make sure you put a pie on the Panther. That helps so much uh, while you're getting things leveled up. Because guys, look, it goes from 14, 19 to 26, 31. That's pretty darn good. And look, you got a frigate bird. I don't care. I win anyway. <laughs> oh my gosh, that chili is so crazy. Um, also, I should say, so Try Hard Tuesday is usually about going for teams that are just like, you know, teams that are try hard. You know, it doesn't take a lot. It's not hard to do. They're really strong. This one's different. This is one just an arena idea I had. And then by the time I finished it, I'm like, this team is so disgusting. I can't feature it outside of Try Hard Tuesdays. Now, it did take me like 20 to 30 attempts, I should say. So I wouldn't say it's the most consistent strat. There's a lot of pets you have to level up high. You need to make sure you get scaling on them too. Like I'm still rocking at one heart, right? Like this isn't really a most consistent, very good strategy, but golly, is it very fun. Uh, we grab our Yeti here to hopefully find more levels for our visitor. Don't find it there. Now, we are still missing um, the Manticore for our team, but that's okay. We'll find it soon. Um, look at the chili here. Look at this, look at this. Boom, 40 damage. We're now doing 40 damage. Oh my gosh, we're almost have enough to one shot a 50-50. That's insane. Now, I pass up the tar there. I don't really care about tar levels as much as I care about visitor and panther levels. It, it didn't really matter if the chili gets onto like the Manticore or the Poodle here. I really only care about it getting onto the Panther. That's the most important thing. And having a level three Panther for max damage and level three um, a Visitor for max exposed is much more uh, important. And look at that Panther chili just cleaning up there. And now you might have seen an effect there. I'll point out next time. Uh, the Now with the Manticore, we are doing 60 damage. And look, we get level three visitors. So that gives us uh, more opportunities for our Panther to just completely destroy the team. Look at this, we have a level two Manticore next turn. That's gonna be awesome. All right, let's check this out. Level three Visitor, level three Panther and a Manticore. Let's see what happens. All right, so they get exposed and then check out this chili. Boom, 60 damage on the monkey. That's crazy. Oh my gosh, do you see in that? 60 damage, looks level two Manticore. We're gonna start doing 80 damage with the chili. Let's go. Come on, here we go. All right, we got the level three. We got the scaling. We got the big panther with the pie. It should hit 50 health here. What do we face? A uh, tiger Jersey Devil summon team with Behemoth Donut. So they're supposed to try to copy a bunch of behemoths. Oh, wait, I messed it up with the whale. Boom, 80 damage on the Jersey Devil with the chili. And we take the win and get the visitor achievement too. Oh, man, that was awesome. Uh, but thank you all so much for watching. Apologies for my outburst earlier in the video. You know, sometimes you just need like a good scream to like de-stress, you know, and that's just what I need. It's been a long day. Uh, but think I'm feeling better now. I love my work. I should say I love my job. It's just, you know, it's been a few days of work in a row and, you know, I just need some rest. But yeah, thank you all so much for watching. Please make sure to like, comment, subscribe, do let you next stuff. I'll catch you all next time. And as always, stay true.